Hey y'all, it's Suleika with Passages of Life Ministries. I wanted to get on here really quick because I've been getting bombarded with these weird messages. <laughs> I normally don't respond to a lot of weird messages, um, but I wanted to read John 16, 33. It says, I have said these things to you that in me, my in me, you may have peace. In the world, you will have tribulations. But take heart that I have overcome the world. So Jesus is telling us in him, we have overcome all these trials and tribulations. So we are overcomers when we put our trust in our faith in Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. So the good news is when we are true Christians and we are true believers and we have given our lives to Jesus and we completely have faith and we stand fast in the word of the Lord, we know that we are overcomers because he told us in his word that we were overcomers because he overcame already for us. He died on the cross for our sins, for our trials, for our tribulations, for everything that we are dealing with right now. Everything that's going on in this world, he already knew. So see, I only expect good things to come. So I've been getting these weird videos left and right. All these weird prophetic videos from in our ministry from all these different people prophesying evil things. And I'm not talking about, you know, this could happen, let's pray over this. I'm talking about get ready because evil's coming and i'm like no i'm gonna tell you right now if you want to send that to our page don't just don't because we believe that we serve a good god we serve a mighty god we serve a god that is so powerful okay the alpha the omega the one that knows the beginning from the end we serve the almighty so we know that all that is for us is good things his whole word says that from the beginning to the end that he created us in his perfect image so he's not gonna let us his believers the ones that have accepted him as lord and savior to any evil to come to to come against us so when I'm receiving all these messages of all this evil is coming and all this stuff is coming and all this, e I'm like, no, I don't receive that. I don't accept that because I serve a good God. I have a good father. I am a child of the living King. And when you start declaring that over your life, when trials and tribulations start to come your way, you know that you are standing on the promises of Jesus. And people are like, oh, Suleika, how could you say that? Because you know, there's the mask epidemic that's happening right now. I say that because I believe that my God is bigger than the whole mask epidemic. I believe that God is bigger than everything that is happening right now and he holds us in his hands so when people are ridiculously saying get ready for this horrible thing that's about to happen i'm like listen i've been ready because i am in the hands of the living king are you are you being driven by fear or are you being driven by faith are you being driven by what the word of God is telling you? That no matter what trials and tribulations you've already overcome? Or are you letting fear be the factor that takes over your life? That everything that you do is defined by what the media is saying. But what people are saying. But what's coming through to you. Are you accepting what is being told to you? Or are you accepting what the word of God says? And you're saying no. Jesus said that I am an overcomer. So me and my house, we are overcomers. God bless you.